Welcome to this week's segment of Convivium New York's ongoing series, Housekeeping Lessons for My Sons. This week we're in the kitchen and we will be learning about shucking oysters for Christmas Day. Here we have our bucket of oysters. We have a bunch of these from Whole Foods that look delicious. And my father is going to show us how to shuck and then these lovely uh, animals. <laughs> <laughs> he beat us to it. <laughs> that's really how you do it right there. Try it out. That's what I was for. Try it out. Okay. Yeah, they're being scrubbed. Short so they're second. Like clean. Okay, yeah. so I'm scrubbing these fellows up. These come from Long Island. They're called Blue Point Oysters. Can anyone say oysters? Oysters. 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 These are <laughs> Blue Point, Point Oysters. oysters. Bit better than Gowanus Canal oysters. <laughs> Whoa, that's right. Susan could have brought those from Brooklyn, the Gowanus Canal oyster. But we decided this time to go with the Long Island New Point oyster. We're scrubbing them up. Am I getting that right, Kate? Oyster. I think we're like the treasurer, and you're a real pain in the neck to the pastor. You say, I am the sand in your oyster. Because what that means is that you help to form the perfect pearl. Right? You are the irritant in the oyster. And you help to form the oh, you need some glasses to see. Okay. Right. All right. Yeah. Let's try another one. <laughs> John, that's yours. <laughs> <laughs> Poor John Miles. Oh. You spilled my coat, yes. man. Uh, yeah, right. Okay. So we need we need one that's gonna give us some beginner's luck here, right? Looks a lot. Looking too good. Maybe it's upside down. It's a lot easier. You have the towel over the top of the towel. You did. Oh, you yeah, use leverage. Oh. Use leverage, you said. I know. That's right. Thank you, Robert. You can't see it, though. You know, that was very important. Thank you. You don't twist, I like pop, pull down on this one, and then you twist later. Okay, I've eased it in there, and now I'm twisting. There we go. All right. Okay. okay, so right, now I'm going to slice along the top. Run along the inner side, he said, right? And over to this side. is we loosen him up from his bottom section here so he is ready to eat. I would say he did a pretty good job on this oyster. Did you get the mud out? There you go. Uh, now we're going to dab at it. It all came to be Okay, there you go. I think it looks pretty clean. I'd say we need a platter. I'd, I'd say... I'd say we need we need my wife to make us a platter of cracked ice. Put this. <laughs> Where's my platter of cracked ice? <laughs> it looks like it has ice on it already. So we'll just pretend. There we go. There you go. Oh, it looks you so good. Is it gonna stay? Oh, right? Is that gonna tip over? Put some paper towels on there. Put I guess some paper towels. Oh, and a lemon. That's why you Kate need has cracked lemons. ice. Huh? Yeah, you know what? Put some paper towel on it. Okay, good enough. Okay. On our way, Excellent work. On our way to rejoice. Merry Christmas. Here we are. Now. And we're going to sample our wares after we get prepared these delicious oysters. And we have, what is that, a Tabasco? No. Uh, horseradish sauce. And we're going to put a Frank's Hot Special on there. Uh, we would use, what's the other stuff that I'm, that I'm not allowed to use? Tabasco sauce. So I have to use Frank's uh, special sauce, red wine sauce, and lemon. I think I'm pretty well good to go. Delicious. Um, yeah,